So this is quite an interesting case of a case of polycystic ovarian syndrome of a lady who has resistant type of polycystic ovarian syndrome, is currently on myonis at all, and who has very irregular cycles. She has tried clomiphene for five days, maximum dose 150 milligram, letrozole for five days, 7.5 milligram, that's the maximum dose. So what did we try this time? The ideal course of action would have been to use injections. She does not want to use them at present. So we tried a final try with letrozole 7.5 milligram for 10 days. Again, not a usual protocol, should be used only with medical guidance. And what did we see? Twice we saw successful ovulation around day 13 to 14. So what does it tell us? It tells us that the follicles can be stimulated that the threshold of follicles, which is high, which, which basically means that these ovaries are quite resistant to the small amount of FSH hormone, and in those cases, prolonging the dose of letrozole may help to recruit follicles. If you do it, you need to do it under medical guidance and have a ultrasound scan done to see that an O response does not happen. So that's something different.